Hey everybody, what is up? Welcome back to some more Pokemon action. I'm your host Ryan, and uh, yeah, uh, like I said, uh, well actually, first of all, sorry for not having a video the other day. Uh, I recently switched to from recording all on one day to recording one episode every day, uh, sort of in preparation for when I start my new job, so I figured it would be the easiest way to do this. Um, and I just completely forgot, and then when I woke up yesterday morning and I, I went to go upload the video, I was like, oh my god, I don't have a video, so hopefully I'll remember from now on, <laughs> so that'd be great. Um, also this team, Marowak and Pelipper aren't going to be staying around for too much longer. I've also started preparing a third team, so once we play a little bit with the next team, we'll have another team to go into. I've got a lot of ideas to play with, so... We've got Finny, Nihilego, Arcanine, Garchomp, Snorlax, and Mandibuzz. Hmm, that's a, uh, that's a toughie. Now, I could go Porygon 2, because it has a pretty decent matchup against everything. And there isn't really any way, well, he might have a taunt, though. That's sort of the issue there. I'm gonna go Porygon 2. I'm gonna go... Hmm... Muck might be a really good lead. Uh, we'll bring Beware in the back, because Beware has a really fantastic matchup here. And uh, Pelipper might actually be pretty good here in the back. Uh, I've got Nihilego and Arcanine, a Water-type move is always fantastic. You've all, this is also like, what, the s second episode we've yet to use Z-Move on Pelipper? Uh, which just kind of leads me to believe it's kind of useless. Um, I don't really know how other people tend to use their Z-moves. Uh, me, personally, I use it for guaranteed KOs or just Araquanid. Because uh, Araquanid, even if I mess up my Z-move, it's still a hell of a lot of damage, you know? Um, so we are going to see the Nihilego and the Arcanine. I kind of expected both. That's sort of why I started off with Muck. Um, purely because Muck just doesn't mind the negative one, because it's already kind of kind of low. Um, we get Beast Boost, which isn't so nice. I'm not too happy about that. Um, but I'm going to go for Trick Room. I'm going to... I'm going to knock off the Nihilego, because I feel like the Nihilego is carrying, carrying some force behind it. So, I think we're going to just try and get out, get rid of what could be a... Oh, ooh, we're going to see a switch out, though. Into Mandibuzz. That is... Interesting. Uh, Flare Blitz off onto the Porygon 2, I think? No, onto the Muck. I'll survive that for sure. He does burn me. It's a little unfortunate, but Muck does provide a lot of utility, so it's not the worst thing in the world. Um, plus, we'll be knocking off the Mandibuzz, so that's actually not too bad at all. Uh, what do we get off? What do we get? What do we get? Lefties. That is good. I like getting rid of those lefties. Um, so next off, what we'll do is we'll knock off the Arcanine, put some utility into that, and we'll go for an Ice Beam. Yeah, an Ice Beam onto the Mandibuzz. I think that's probably the best thing I can do here. So Ice Beam onto the Mandibuzz, knock off onto the Arcanine. It should still do a decent amount of damage, even though I'm burnt. Who's going to withdraw the Arcanine as well? Into the Snorlax. That is fantastic. I like that. Because uh, we're going to knock off its definite berry. Definite berry's going down. Um, sweet. So, we got rid of its figgy berry, which means we can knock it, um, we can actually try and go for a poison here. That ice beam did a pretty decent amount, not gonna lie. Alright, um, I think I'll go for the poison onto this, I'll go for another ice beam onto the, actually, I'll go for the thunderbolt, because we now know his whole team, so I don't have to worry about, um, thunderbolting into a Garchomp. Or, there was another thing that I didn't want to thunderbolt into. No, there wasn't. There wasn't. So, uh, we'll go for Thunderbolt now, because Thunderbolt hits the rest of his team a little bit better. Uh, and we'll go for a Poison Jab, try and get a Poison onto the Snorlax. Uh, who's probably gonna go for either a Curse or a Belly Drum. Recycle, but it fails! Oh, man, that's actually really good to know. I, I wasn't 100% sure if that would work. Do we get the Poison? We do not get the Poison. Alright. Um, I wasn't sure if Recycle would work after a knockoff. I've never really looked into it. It does go for the Roost. Hmm. Am I losing offensive pressure? I don't think I'm losing too much here. Because uh, if I do get that poison off onto the Snorlax, that would be fantastic. Um, I'm probably just going to double into this Snorlax. I'm going to Thunderbolt and Poison Jab it. Just kind of get it out of the way. This is actually one of those situations where I really did wish I have uh, had... um. Uh, 
Mimikyu, because Mimikyu is actually probably really good into this matchup. Can burn, has damage, has pain split. Porygon 2 has damage here. Definitely more than Mimikyu, but... I don't know. It's not really doing much for me. I really would have probably liked to either burn... If this doesn't poison, I, I definitely would have liked to have a burn on it by now. And it's probably not. Yeah, it's not going to burn it. Damn it. I kind of expected the Mandibuzz to go for a Roost here. This is why I'm kind of doubling into it. And he does go for the Roost, so... Kind of would make my turns pretty useless, you know? So, I want to look at how many turns left of Trick Room we have. No, I think I have to go for the Recover now. I don't have much of a choice. Uh, but looking at the rest of his team, Nihilego... Nihilego, what was it, Arcanine? Yeah, I do want to trick him up. Alright, I probably misplayed this. Oh, we only have one more turn left to trick him? Alright, cool. I can Nope, not, not trick him. I want to go for recover. Thank you very much. Now, let's try and get that poison jab off. If he was smart, he would double into the Porygon 2 here. That's what I would do. But, we don't know what he's going to do. Well, I'm really hoping to get a poison on this Snorlax because my muck got burnt from that flare. Why does everything... In this game, every fire type attack. Oh my god, I can't believe I survived that. Why does every fire type attack in this game actually burn? Like, that's a little ridiculous, don't you think? That was just a tad bit ridiculous. So, what I'm gonna do here, I think. Why are you going for foul play? Oh, okay. Yeah, that actually probably wouldn't, that most definitely wouldn't have killed me last turn. Um, and we do survive where I think we, Muck should survive. Hell yeah, Muck. Hell yeah. So what we do here is we go for the Trick Room. Yeah, we go for the Trick Room. And we go for the Poison Jab onto the Snorlax. If I wasn't burnt, this would have been such a different situation. Wait, why do you go for Tailwind? What? You fool! You fool! <laughs> you just doomed yourself! What is he doing? He's gonna return the Porygon too, but that shouldn't kill me. Oh my god, you fool! You fool! Poison will kill me, I'll die to burn, and then I bring on my two sweepers. You fool! <laughs> I love it. Yeah, poison does kill me. Beautiful! Why did he go for Tailwind? That doesn't make much sense to me. That does not make much sense to me. I do not understand that one. Um, so yeah, I just bring in Beware. I could go for the... Ice Punch onto Mandibuzz, but I don't know what Mandibu how strong Mandibuzz is. He's not really a, a doubles Pokemon, so never really had much interaction with him. Uh, let's see, Pelipper. Pelipper Hydro Pump. Duh. Oh, do I have Hydro Pump? I think I have Hydro Pump. So in Rain, it's a almost two-hit KO. But if I do Z-Move, it's a near two-hit KO. Damn it! <laughs> That's not good. Um... How much does beware? How much does ice punch do? Ice punch. Ice punch is not even a two hit KO. G oh, I'm not life. I'm life orb. I'm life orb. Wow, that, that's awful. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a return onto Snorlax. I don't want to miss the hammer arm, and I'm gonna go for a Z hydro pump onto the Mandibuzz. If it's not running any special investment, this one's 252. Um, we will KO it, so that's okay. Um, but yeah, if if this thing's not doesn't have a, a minimal investment into special attack in special defense, sorry, we will one shot it. Otherwise, we'll notice what it said is, and then it it most likely won't be able to tank another return. So that's good. Probably wasn't expecting this either. <laughs> not gonna lie. Um, Let's see, we could probably just knock it down with an Ice Punch next turn, if this doesn't KO. Yeah, okay, so you are you are the standard Mandibuzz. He does go for Toxic, which I think was kind of a misplay. Foul Play would have probably done a lot to my Pelipper. But we'll see, we'll see. Kind of depends on what he brings in next, and if it has like a Sash or something. Oh my god, I'm going to rely on, on hy Hydro Pump. Okay, uh, not a big deal. <laughs> we can land it. I'm gonna return the Mandibuzz. I'm gonna Hydro Pump 
the Nihilego. Hopefully we can land. Hopefully it's not Sash. Okay, good. So we do kill the Mandibuzz. Beautiful. Is he Rocky Helmet? No, he's not Rocky Helmet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We knocked off his leftovers. I remember now. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Hydro Pump lands. Please don't be Sash. Oh, it's Sash! No! Damn, that burn literally ruined us. <laughs> and he's going to kill us with the Power Gem. For sure. Yeah, there's no way we're surviving that. Hey, Pelipper did something this game. Something. Not a lot, but something. Um, now we're in a really bad position, because we're going to be at negative one against a full health Arcanine and a, uh, Nihilego. And I don't think the Nihilego can kill us in two hits, so as long as we can one-shot this Arcanine, which isn't going to happen, um, we should be fine. We're, but we're not going to. So basically, by getting the burn with the Flare Blitz, um, we, we kind of got screwed over, because we would have had Muck around. To get KOs. I think. I don't know. So yeah, I'm gonna go for return on Arcanine. I don't have much of a choice. That's all my move in me. Because I, I believe we can survive at least one or two. Ooh. Ooh, that was really nice, actually. Oh, he goes for close combat. Boo. So if I was running double edge... Wow, that, I actually take that like a champ. If I was running double edge, uh, that would have been fine. But I wasn't. And I died of that. Yeah. If I was running double edge, I would have taken him out. But the reason I was, I'm not running double edge is because, generally speaking, it's not super important on Beware. Uh, there aren't really any KOs that I need specifically for double edge. Um, it's not that much stronger than return. I hope I have the right return. I actually forgot to check that. <laughs> now that I think about it, I totally forgot to check the return. Damage. Ah, uh, that actually might have come into play then. I'll let you know in the next in the next video. So we're gonna continue battling. You wanna go down? Okay, come on. All right. So, yeah, <laughs> that was awful. That was awful. We are we we have we've had some pretty bad luck in these past couple episodes. Not much to say about that though. Uh, we've got Arcanine. Garnery, pretty interesting. Pangoro, pretty interesting. Tapu Bulu, Slowbro, and Braviary. Hmm. This is definitely... Well... Maybe not definitely. Uh, I'm looking at these leads. I might like Pelipper lead. Yeah, I actually really do like Pelipper lead here. Um... Who's a good Trick Room setter against this team? I mean, Mimik Mimikyu is pretty good against this team. Yeah, I like Mimikyu here. Um, let's bring Marowak. Marowak has a really good matchup against this team. And do I want Beware or Muck? Beware hits Pangoro and Bulu. Yeah, no, Muck is definitely better here. Sorry, Beware. <laughs> Didn't mean to, to stiff you on that one. But yeah, no, I think Muck has a better matchup. Because Knock Off, Poison Jab, Shadow Snake just works a little bit better here. Alright, so who's he going to lead off with? You know, if he starts Arcanine, I can just protect with my Pelipper. No big deal. Why did I catch that Pelipper in an Ultra Bar Ball? What? Huh. So you think he's just gonna go for Trick Room here? Hmm. That's a good question. I'm not gonna risk it though. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a Hydro Pump onto the Braviary and I'm gonna go for a Trick Room. I'm not gonna risk it just in case the Slowbro is running uh, like Thunderbolt or something. Uh, this way I'll definitely get off my damage with Pelipper before I lose it. Unless Braviary targets the Pelipper, which I don't really expect. I expect him to want to take out the Mimikyu if he's not going to go for Trick Room. Go for U-Turn. Interesting. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. So switching in for... I'm trying to think what he want to switch into this. Hopefully it's like a, uh, so a his Arcanine. His Arcanine would be great here. Arcanine would be fantastic. Go for Arcanine, my man. Come on. Skarmory. Skarmory's okay. 
Uh, wait, why Skarmory? What's Skarmory gonna do? Avoids. Damn it, really? Wait, really? Okay, so that actually probably didn't really make too much of a difference. Um, that was weird. I don't... I'm not sure I understood that one, that play. Uh, but we know he has that. I don't need... Alright, I'm just gonna go for the Z move here. I, I don't see why not. Uh, there's no real reason not to. I'm gonna go for the Z move onto Skarmory, and I'm gonna go for a Will O Wisp onto Slowbro just to get some of that residual damage. Oh, and it's Amnesia, so that's great. My Muck will be able to completely bop it later. Although it's slower than my. Well, slow. Yeah, Slowbro's pretty slow. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. We'll see. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna hit this thing as hard as I can with a Hydro Vortex. It's not, it's not as strong as a, an Araquanid, but uh, it should do its job. These animations make no sense for special attacks. Oh shit, that actually was almost, that was a one hit KO. Hot damn. Now if I burned the Skarmory there, that would have been a KO, but hey, I didn't even think of that. I did not even think of that. Stealing? Really? Oh man, that, that is your fault. <laughs> that is your fault, compadre. <laughs> I don't know why you're running Steelwing. Alright, I'm gonna go for Hurricane onto Slowbro, even though it's plus uh, two special defense. And I'm just gonna play rough the Skarmory, just get it off the field. Steelwing, man! I wouldn't have even. That was a probably a three hit KO if it's, if it's a regular Skarmory, if it's an offensive Skarmory. Probably still not that much. I'm gonna look at what Skarmory's base attack is. Wait, really? Oh, I forgot he had that. Uh, Skarmory's base attack is 80. Okay, so that's not too bad, but it, it wouldn't have done enough. Man, this trick- Oh, we get the confusion! Nice! I hate confusion, though. <laughs> it's, it's very unreliable, this gen, so no big deal. Alright, what are we gonna see? Okay, Rocky Helmet. Good to know. Double team? Why? Oh my god, seriously? Ooh, this is not good. I'm gonna swap out my Mimikyu here. I'm gonna go for a... I can't go for Hurricane on Skarmory anymore. That's not good. I wish I knew that he was gonna go for double... What the hell is this team, man? <laughs> what the hell is this team? Alright, I'm gonna bring in Muck here, because Muck can uh, knock off the, the Slowbro. Hopefully Slowbro hits itself, hits itself, hits itself. Hallelujah. So I'm trying to kill the Slowbro because I think... Oh, did we crit it? Really? 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 That made my entire switch pointless. What the hell, man? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that literally made my entire switch completely pointless. Oh my god, that's not what I wanted it to do. Come on, really? <laughs> so salty. But at, at least, at least uh, we made up for that. By getting the by getting the confusion hit, so our muck didn't take any damage on the way in. Because honestly, that would have been awful. <laughs> like, could you imagine? All right, so I'm gonna go for a hurricane onto Braviary, and I'm gonna go for a knockoff onto Skarmory. Just get rid of its a um, its rocky helmet. Hopefully, we don't miss. That's gonna suck. God dang, why do you have double team Skarmory? It's hard enough to kill already. <laughs> like, seriously? Alright, well, Hurricane should do a decent amount of damage to Braviary. We have one more turn left of rain and stuff. Um, oh, wait, what? Wait, why? What? That made no sense! Why would you switch that in? What the hell? <laughs> what? Why would you switch the Pangoro in? That was the worst play! What are you doing? This is why you don't run Double Team Skarmory. It's gonna annoy me that he's running Double Team Skarmory. If I could just get a burn off on him, this is- well, no, he is Roost. Ugh. Still a little salty that he, uh... Double Team, man. Damn! How am I going to beat the Skarmory? That's the question. That's the real question. How am I going to beat the Skarmory? I should have doubled into it, but I thought it would be enough. I completely spaced on, um, on, uh, 
on Roost and Sturdy. I completely forgot about those. That was my bad. Go for Rock Slide. Oh, I wish I knew you were running Rock Slide. Oh, I don't play these Pokemon. Wow, that actually did no damage. What? Wait, what is this Skarmory running that... Not, not Skarmory. What is this Braviary running that it didn't one-hit KO Pelipper? It has 123 base attack. How did that not kill me? I am very confused right now. Oh, wow, okay. So, Rock Slide... Wow, it really doesn't do very much. What did we knock off? I wasn't paying attention. I'm gonna go for Wide Guard. I'm gonna go for that Poison Jab. Yeah, Wide Guard will stop. The Rock Slide... I think he's gonna be Choiced. Oh, wait, he's not Choiced anymore. What am I saying? If he is, he, he's, he got knocked off. Oh, Brave Bird. Okay, actually, that's fine. I should survive whatever he dishes out here. Because he's definitely not choice banned. Oh my god! Holy crap! <laughs> Mock your dog! <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Skarmory goes for Brave Bird. Wait, did he double into the muck? He did, wow. What a cheeky bastard. And he still doesn't kill me. Beautiful. That's actually amazing that he didn't kill me there. Still, like, okay, okay. I could play this game. Uh, I'm gonna go for Hydro Pump onto the Skarmory, and I guess I go for a knockoff. Monk is pretty much useless in this matchup now. Double team. Wow, ah, it's plus six evasion. No, plus three evasion. So it's still in our favor. Well, for everything but Hydro Pump. <laughs> Scald would have been much appreciated here. But that's fine. Not much we can do about that. Our Pelipper's pretty much useless against the Skarmory, but we can win just by attacking it. I wish I brought Scald. Scald would have been very important here. And if I just doubled into him... I, honestly, I just completely forgot about Sturdy, and even if I didn't forget about Sturdy, it's not like Skarmory's a threat. So that, that wasn't really... That wasn't really, you know, a misplay. That was just... A weird set that you can't ac account for. So I'm gonna go for Shadow Sneak here because I kind of assume he's gonna attack me. I don't know if that was the right play. Yeah, no, that was the right play. Beautiful. Like a book. Oh, come on, really? Alright, well, we're gonna bring out Mimikyu here. Uh, I'm gonna go for Trick Room the first turn because I will survive a, a Steel Wing. Ooh, actually, this was the better play I can do. Because he cannot, he cannot one-hit KO me, because he, he doesn't have any offensive boosts here. So he's going to go for that stealing. Mm, nice. Yeah, it's just a Skarmory, baby. It's just a Skarmory. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> I, do have, I do have Marowak in the back, so this isn't the worst position to be in. Um, I'm debating whether or not to to risk the the burn, but I think I'm going to. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk the burn here because I can get a lot of damage off with the the pain split. Oh hell yes, Pelipper! Hell oh is that a KO? No, it's not. Damn it! Maybe I shouldn't have gone. Oh whoa wait he's really slow, isn't he? That was a that was a good recovery. I can't believe I landed a hydro pump finally. Oh I landed the Will O Wisp too. Oh my god, that is amazing. Alright, good stuff. Good stuff. Now on a timer, sort of. I, if you could poison him, that, that'd be even better, but no. Um, then I'm gonna go for Paint Split. Because he's definitely gonna. He's either gonna double team or, or protect. Or roost or whatever. Yeah, roost. So I'll gain a lot of HP back here. Now the question is should I just. I think I'm just gonna swap into Marowak here. Don't see why not. And I could just keep doing that to be quite on. Well, maybe not. All right, yeah, I'm gonna swap out my Pelipper for Marowak. Keep that thing alive as best as I can, and I guess we'll just go for a play rough. Might lower its attack, kind of worth. I don't know why he's stalling this out. As long as I land one Flare Blitz, he's dead. Can we get a, an attack lower? No. Okay, so four double teams, plus four evasion. 
We just need to land one Flare Blitz, and I think we have like 15 tries. Let me see. 24 tries, so we're bound to win this no matter what. Um, yeah, I'll just go for another player off, I guess. If we land the first one, we win, so. Damn it. Oh, he is just straight up attacking this Marowak. That's a good play. That is not a good play, never mind. <laughs> I take that back. Is there any move that I have that doesn't miss? That's the question. Trick Room's over, by the way. So he's gonna roost. Well, he, he might roost. Uh, does Shadow Bone miss? What? No, no. Accuracy 100. Accuracy 100. Accuracy 90, but not I would I wouldn't use I wouldn't use that on. Oh wait, what? Oh, oh, I thought I clicked Trick Room. I was like, why is it single target? <laughs> Did something change? <laughs> Mid battle, was there a patch? <laughs> Uh, so he's gonna go for stealing, probably trying to kill the Mimikyu, which I think is just a poor play. Poor decision. Yes! Good game! Let's go, Marowak! There's no way he's surviving that. Hell yeah! 26 minutes in, double team Skarmory, screw you! <laughs> Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching, I really do appreciate it. And I- ow, frick, ow, my teeth. I just hit myself in the face with my headphones. I appreciate it, and I hope to catch you guys at the next episode. Peace.